Hey guys, I've got some awesome news. The company Inventables is sponsoring my YouTube channel and they just sent me an X-Carve CNC router. Let's take a look. So the X-Carve CNC router has a 800 by 800 millimeter bed with I believe a two and a half inch vertical axis and it's capable of engraving and cutting wood and even aluminum. Comes with some uh, sample materials. Let's see, We've got some kind of composite uh, high density polyethylene, black on white. We've got some, this looks like bamboo, I think. What's this? Fluorescent green acrylic sheet. Ooh, that'd be cool. Just some stuff to sample with, I guess. This comes with a nice little letter explaining the company. All right. So we got, this is the heart of the machine. This is the spindle. The mounting bracket, some wrenches. Core components. Well, that's a big box. All right, so we got all our main frame pieces. This is all nice, big formed and machined aluminum. Wow, look at that. That's some good build quality. And I believe this is a tool kit designed especially for the router. That's awesome. All the wrenches you'll need. Allen keys, screwdriver. Yeah, that's fantastic. Sample bits, all the wiring, nice cable track, more wiring. There's the Z-axis Acme screw. Got the power supply, and a motion controller. Oh. And of course, because it's a very open friendly company, it uses an Arduino. And NEMA 23 stepper motors. So I got the um, fully loaded X-Carb. You can get a smaller one, which is uses smaller NEMA motors, but uh, had to go big or go home, right? Anyway, a wood clamp set, lots of cool stuff. So I'm going to build this up and then stay tuned in a few weeks for a complete review of the system. And then I'm going to start using it on some of my projects. And I'm really excited. So I have a few ambitious ideas that I want to use this X-Carver with. So the one thing I'm wondering is I might be able to drop the bed out and use my plasma cutter with it mounted far enough away from the CNC router that the sparks don't hurt it. Which then means I can plasma cut up to half inch steel plate using the CNC software that came with this router. Another idea is if you can make it portable like that, why couldn't you turn it into a portable CNC router? So for example, you want to engrave a pattern on say concrete or something, you can set the CNC router down and uh, engrave there. Or do you have a, a workpiece that's too big to fit inside the router? So those are some of my ideas that I want to use this router for. I'm really excited to uh, start playing around with it. So let's build it.